Okay, today we're looking at the Gerard 630, and um, this <laughs> this particular turntable is scary nice. Um, I, it was scary when I saw it. It's scary when I cleaned it up. It's scary when I took it apart and didn't have to do anything to it. No, I did, but. Um, it's rare that you see something in such a good, such good condition and looks so cool. Um, and one of the coolest things about it is, and I'm not a fan of stickers on any kind of electronics, but um, <laughs> the coolest thing is that the cover, it's like it's in a showroom, has a sticker. It's just the camera. Okay. Um, sure magnetic cartridge. Disc is queuing. Adjustable anti-skate. Hinge desk cover. The lights to ride. Um, it's so nice. Um, in every way. The only thing that's wrong, that's wrong with it is it doesn't have a, um, doesn't have a, a nameplate in this in the spot on the dust cover. And look at this dust cover, it's scary. I was cleaning it up and I was gonna start, you know, picking it and like no. It looks too cool. Um and you know the same thing happened. Usually I change the cartridge out and the uh stylus and it sounded so good and it looked so good I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't make myself do that. So this one it can't be used that that much. Oh yeah, let's do the let's do the hinge d desk cover. Okay, it fits right in. It's, re it's really really quite easy. And then, oops, sorry, I'm making it look more difficult than it is. Let's bring it back. I can't even see it <laughs> in the camera. But it's cool, you know. It's really pretty. It's um, three speed. A weird thing about this that I noticed is that uh, um, let me get over here. Um, um, weird lighting. I'm in the shop. Okay, my garage. And um, see. Oh, that's what I want to show you. On the here. Okay. See, it has the speeds, um, but it has the 33 if you're playing a 45. If you're a 33, if you're playing a 12-inch. Um, it's so funny. So, it's kind of cool, actually, because some record players, they limit you, and they're, the speed will vary on different sizes. Okay. So, um, isn't that it's just amazing? Mm -hmm. And then... Um, I mean, really, nice, sturdy, I mean, you know, 70s, but sturdy plinth. Oh, I also put, um, let me take off the hinge with, that's cover while I show you. I did, um, put on some of these, because I am really sold on these. Um, these are the um, Hudson, which is what I'm using mostly. And they're, they're better in the picks, but um, just next to the original, in case someone you know didn't like that or wanted to change it, um, they just come off. They have um, like two-sided tape on the back, um, but it makes a huge difference. Not on this um, little table that I set up for to do this, but um, on regular we would we would normally place it. So. Let's be authentic to it. We're at home. <laughs> okay, so we are to it. Um, it's really beautiful. I uh, everything works. It has queuing. Um, has the lock for the. This is a sure um, cartridge, and it sounds so nice. I couldn't. <laughs> I couldn't change it out. I 
got one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, I, I don't have to put six on, but I guess I'm. I mean, it's, it ends up taking so long, okay? Um, and the reason why I do the demos is to show people how to use the product and actually to show them that all the functions do work because you really never know what you're going to get sometimes when you order something that really looks really well. It looks really good because, you know, I can edit pictures as well. But I really feel like that, that I have a really clean product. Pretty obsessive about that. So anyway, let's go and make sure we're on 3312. And this is a real soft touch. It's, it's awesome, so you don't have to be rough at all. And um, just click it once to automatic. And boom. And bring it down. Get it closer in. There we go. My receiver's not easily... I'm gonna go turn it up. It's probably... Volume's probably down. Uh, it's on the wrong speed. This should be 45. Uh oh, we're gonna have to play a game then. I didn't split them. Okay, we ready? Stop, don't do that. No, I can't. I, I can't do that anymore. It really bothers me. Oh, it's on 40. This is a good trick. It's on 7, so I have to put it on. Oh no, I don't even want to play these because I can't do it. Wow, that's bizarre. Okay, okay. Cut. Okay, we're going to check the speed level, the RPMs on the Gerard 630. Um, I've got my RPM app on the uh, on the turntable, so we'll go ahead and we're on 33. Oh my God! I can't even. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm so excited. Ah! Slap him. Okay, 33.37. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. Let's see if 45 is the same. Um, and it could not be. Right? Uh, oops, 33 still. Four point nine three nine four. Wow, that that is one of the closest scores I've ever seen. I don't ever, I don't think I've ever seen it right on, because um, I'm dealing with the. I guess some people call these lower end, but I don't think so. Um. Wow, that's awesome. It's really awesome. And if seventy eight, we'll try seventy eight. But if my phone flies off, then. We're out of here. Mm -hmm. 
77.9191991. That's amazing. That's amazing. So, not only is this turntable beautiful, it is almost perfect on speed. It's really easy to use. It's a really light finger touch. Um, just don't put it on a tool cart like I have mine on. Um, I hope you like it. I hope you love it. I hope you buy it. Thank you. Oh. Okay, my phone. Dude, I don't know. 